Hey everybody, it's Scott and Peggy here, uh, and today we're with Jeff from Pest Band Pest Control Company. Uh, he actually learned of these bees in this block wall. He called us. He wants to learn how to uh, how to remove bees and not kill the bees. That's what I like. It. That's a good pest control guy there. Doesn't want to kill the bees. Wants to be able to remove the bees. So he's here to kind of learn a little bit about the process. And if you can see. We've got this hole here, the bees are coming and going. They look pretty active, pretty strong colony. Uh, we understand they've been here for about three months or so, but I'm longer. assuming we're gonna find that they've been here a little longer. So we're gonna go ahead and open it up and see what we got. Yeah, this is uh, Scott's bee. Um, all right, there they are. They've also got a second little hole down here that occasionally a bee comes from. But uh, as far as the thermometer and everything goes, they should be fairly close to that entrance. So we're going to start there and work our way up. It's actually uh, 20, oh, ounces. Oh, 20, you guys. Ounce. 20 ounces. 20 ounces. There's you guys one stinging right there. Action, so if, they start stinging, so if you get stung, okay. you scrape it out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Been there, and then they, they leave a uh, they leave a attack pheromone yeah. at the sting site. Yeah. Smells like bananas. It it yeah, it smells like bananas. So if you smell that. No. All right, baby. That's let's get the uh, let's get the vacuum going. Okay, there we have it. It's exposed. Goes. It's basically eight feet long. Goes from the bottom all the way up to the lintel. Now this lintel is not poured, so it's just a hollow block into uh, into the attic space. So we're hoping that it doesn't continue into the sophic or, or into the attic. But we're going to let them rust for a little bit and uh, gather, so we can vacuum some more, and then we'll. Be back to it. He said a lot of words that a lot of people can approve of. <laughs> well, you think biker parties are fun? Wait till you get a bunch yeah, of beekeepers. Yeah, because the bee and the stuff these people make is incredible. So, Talk about a party. I think my wife will enjoy it. We brought a whole pig to get a cooler. 
Alright, here's your worker brood. Right, right, right. These are larvae. These are pupae. Actually, you can probably find them in there. Yeah, that's always fun. Yeah, they get smaller and smaller and smaller. We didn't bring it. Do you want two boxes? Yeah, like in a the sun to get down in there. Right. Ooh, I see it. Okay, then. Yeah. Now, oh, they hate sunglasses, when we're grafting queens, we use a larva that's that size. So it's less of a little bit. We'll use that. Hey, Scott, you want a big box? This is going to be enough for all this. I don't know. Maybe the brood stops right about right here. Okay, that's what you got. Yeah. Just like honey, I'll fix a toast. Yeah, and then it's easy. We're just a couple of spoonfuls. Yeah. You're giving feed the in the right direction, right? Yes, ma'am. It's the same way we're doing it. Oriented, exactly. Really? Yeah. Yeah, these, these cells are all actually angled right. 9 degrees. Okay, here we go, guys. Peggy's scraping out the last of the comb. We haven't found the queen yet. We don't know if she's in the, the box, one of the vacuum boxes or not. But as you can see, we've gotten the comb out of there. Now we left one piece of comb, hoping that she'll migrate to it. And if we don't find her after a little while, we'll probably leave, there's the piece right there. We'll probably leave that there overnight and come back in the morning and see if she's found it yet. Uh, with a block wall like this, there's a lot of gaps and cracks that they can move off to the sides. So anywhere I could, I sprayed a little bee quick in the wall, hoping to drive any bees out of there, but she might be in it. So we'll give them some time and find out. Hi everybody, day two, that means it's 9-11 today. Um, when we came back, there was a beard of bees about here, thick all the way to the wall. I vacuumed them up real quick and sprayed bee go in all the cracks. And I guess you can see, in this box here where I vacuumed them up that the queen's in there. Everybody's joining right now. So I'll vacuum one more time and then we're done. The end of the story. Hey, have a happy, sticky, sweet day. We are. <laughs>